Hello and welcome to the College of Engineering and Computer Science at UTC. My name is Daniel Pack and I serve as a Dean of the College. I want to congratulate you for starting your college journey at UTC, an important first step toward a wonderful career in your future. It is indeed a great time to become an engineer, computer scientist, or technologist as the world increasingly becomes more depend upon advanced technologies and the benefits that they bring to the society. Here at the college, you'll receive excellent education from outstanding faculty members. You'll also find opportunities to get involved with student organizations, competition teams, professional development workshops and programs, internship and undergraduate research programs, to just name a few. I can't wait to greet you in person this fall. Again, welcome, congratulations, and go Mocs. My portion of the presentation will give you a high-level overview of the college in three areas. Our students learning through solving real-world problems called applied research, and student success through community engagement. First, I want to give you a brief history of the college, its vision, and its mission. The origin of the college started with a general engineering program in 1947 at the University of Chattanooga. When the University of Chattanooga joined the University of Tennessee system and changed its name to the University of Tennessee at Chattanooga in 1969, the engineering program, still offering a single Bachelor of Science degree in engineering, started to grow both in size and expertise. The program became the College of Engineering and Computer Science in 1977. From a handful of faculty members and a small student population in 1969, today we now have over 1,600 students majoring in eight undergraduate, four masters, and one PhD degree programs. As of last year, our students come from 65 Tennessee counties, 20 states, and 13 nations. The academic programs are administered by five departments, civil and chemical engineering, computer science and computer engineering, electrical engineering, engineering management and technology, and mechanical engineering. The vision of the college is to become a preeminent college in two areas, education and applied research. That is, the college is pursuing to give its students the best education and to be one of the best in applied research. The mission of the college is made of the th three following submissions, preparing future workforce for the state, the nation, and the beyond, discovering knowledge, and finally engaging communities through scholarship, service, and economic development. Let's talk about our students. 90% of our undergraduates are full-time students, and 17% of them are adult learners. Almost 20% of our students are first-generation college students, 15% of our students are female, and 71 of our students are veterans. Next, applied research. Applied research simply means finding answers to industry and societal problems through technological means. Gaining experience in finding answers to such questions is vital for you to become a good engineer, computer scientist, engineering or construction manager, or technologist of the future. The graph shows that the amount of research funding our faculty attracts each year is significant, reflecting increasing number of opportunities for students to participate in the applied research process. Our students also succeed outside of classroom by participating in internships, undergraduate research, student organizations and competition teams, and community service. Here are a few examples that show potential opportunities waiting for you. Matt is an electrical engineering undergraduate who worked on a mini satellite program and interned at SpaceX. 
He is now pursuing his graduate degree in electrical engineering. Cooper was a chemical engineering student who went to Japan to study nanotechnology as part of his summer fellowship program. We have a number of student competition teams that travel across the nation to compete with other collegiate teams at a variety of venues, learning to work in a team, solving problems in real time, and interacting with others from around the nation. One of these teams, Rocket Mox, brought home a national title of launching a custom-designed rocket and achieving the highest altitude in 2018. And the team from last year broke a world record putting UTC on the world map. You will also find our students serving the Chattanooga community by volunteering in STEM affairs, helping high school and junior high school teachers teach computer programming and engineering to their students, managing database for the Hamilton County government, and lending hands to those who need support using the knowledge and skills they have learned in their classes. I encourage you to be involved and take advantage of these opportunities for learning and growth. Again, welcome to the College of Engineering and Computer Science at UTC. I look forward to meeting you in person and getting to know more about you very soon. My name is Michael Coleman. In middle school, they actually made us um, take a class over like careers. And so there is this kind of personality test that, you know, asks you a bunch of questions of your personality. And so I was like, well, I know what most of these are, uh, but I don't know what chemical engineering is. And so the point of the class was to research the topic that came out of that, uh, that personality test. I was actually a equipment manager for the football team. And that's how I actually came to UTC. So I was going to do the Tennessee Promise and take two years at a community college and then transfer. The football program paid for my way to go to school those first couple of years. And now here I am with these opportunities I would have never imagined. With chemical engineering, we take an intro to chemical engineering class. And we work on like a lot of basic engineering concepts. And it adds to the the scope of what chemical engineers can do. And it's a very broad range. And I was like, yes, this is really what I want to do. This is why I'm here. Um, then being able to go to the labs and go see everything that College of Engineering is doing has continued to just, you know, add that backbone and go like, hey, this is really what I want to do. Yeah, I took a year off to do a co-op, which is a year long internship. I did that with Shaw Industries and I really enjoyed the manufacturing side. I really enjoyed in the business, how to improve on manufacturing process. Over the course of that year, I was at two different plants. At the first plant, I worked on what is called a dye line. And so we take, took the carpet and dyed it different colors. You know, I was trying to work on the efficiency of that. And on the dye line, we actually implement, implemented a new spray system, which could save the uh, company, I think, I believe, I think it was two cents a square foot which when you run multi-millions of square feet, we were able to save up to $2 million for a year. It's kind of crazy to think about that. And then on the second semester, there are these nozzles, um, mechanical nozzles that were worn down because of the yarn. And, you know, it's kind of the yarn, it just wiggles within the nozzle, which is millimeters, uh, you know, wide. And you know, we, we found that when the nozzles hit a certain uh, roughness, we were able to, uh, you know, it started to lose its efficiency in the machine. And so we were able to optimize that efficiency. And in that semester, I was able to save uh, that plant $400,000. I was very anxious about taking a year off, but, you know, I was able to, you know, get that solid backbone, that solid foundation. It was just an added push, uh, you know, solid, I guess, force just like, me up and like, hey, is it really what you want to do? Whether it's, you know, lowering the cost of a good or researching a solution for people to use. And I know that 
I can leave an impact on people and hopefully make people's lives better. Welcome from the College of Engineering and Computer Science Center for Student Success. My name is Julie David and I serve as the director of the CECS Success Center. We are housed on the third floor of the ENCS building in room 344. We opened our doors in the spring of 2017 to provide support, encouragement, and resources for engineering and computer science students as they pursue their degree. Visit us for resources and services in academic advising, professional development, experiential learning, success skills, student life, and outreach. We'd like to also invite you to join us during our Welcome Week event, Full STEM Ahead, on the first day of classes, August 17th. Come see us on Fridays where we serve popcorn every Friday in the fall and the spring semester. We wish you the best of luck in your academic year. Go Mox! We welcome you to the 2020 New Student Orientation. The CECS Center for Student Success serves as a one-stop shop for our students providing academic advising, professional development, success workshops, outreach, and connecting our students with experiential learning opportunities. Now let's meet the CECS advising team. Lisa Tarr serves as the college advising coordinator. She's the first point of contact for new transfer students and she advises civil and chemical engineering majors. She is the staff mentor to our peer tutors. Sarah also Brooks advises mechanical engineering and mechatronics majors. She serves as the staff mentor to our peer advisors. Carmela Castro advises our computer science and computer engineering majors. We are in the process of hiring a new advisor to electrical engineering and engineering technology management majors. Free peer tutoring will be available in the fall and spring semesters. Our tutors are CECS upperclassmen who have earned Dean's List standing. Students may schedule small group sessions through our Navigate Scheduling system. Our Outreach Coordinator, Sarah Jackson, led over 200 outreach activities in the 2019-2020 academic year. In collaboration with CECS faculty, staff, and student leaders, Sarah coordinated visits to elementary, middle, and high schools, community colleges, and community events. Sarah is also our staff mentor to our student ambassadors. Our student ambassadors support events and activities sponsored by the college. They welcome potential students and assist community partners and visitors to the CECS. Ambassadors provide service to the college, the university, and the extended Chattanooga community by representing CECS as goodwill ambassadors. We invite you to join us at the Welcome Week event, Full STEM Ahead. This event is held on the first day of classes, August 17th from 11 to 1. Get On Board Day is our annual recruitment event for CECS clubs and organizations. You will meet student leaders for more than 25 clubs and orgs. Join a club, win a door prize, pick up a t-shirt, eat lunch and network with other CECS students. Join us on September 9th from 11 to 1 in the EMCS Courtyard. The college hosts two career fairs per year, one in November and one in March, averaging 55 employer guests each semester. In preparation for the fair, we host professional development events so that our students are ready for the big day. These events include Resume Doctor, Backpack to Briefcase, handshake workshops, and suit-up event. Every new CECS student is matched with a mentor. Your mentor is a current upper division student who volunteers to provide one-on-one -on -one support throughout the academic year. You will be connected with a mentor 
based on interests, area of study, needs, and preferences. A mentor can offer insight and suggest the best way to achieve your goals. They can share tips on how to manage stressors and give advice on networking effectively when navigating the job market. They can also motivate you to be the best version of yourself. Simply hold your camera over the QR code, click the link, and sign up today. Nicole Wake is our newest member to the success team. Serving as career counselor within the college, Nicole offers one-on-one -on -one professional guidance with resume writing, job search techniques, interview skills, dress for success, and tips in preparation for our career fairs. We encourage each and every student to participate in at least one experiential learning opportunity. The Success Center is here to help connect you with industry partners to offer internships or co-op education, service learning, or job shadows. You might prefer to participate in faculty-led research or study abroad. All CECS students finish their academic career with the Senior Design Project. The College of Engineering and Computer Science has partnered with more than 400 companies offering student support through research, labs, design projects, internships, co-ops, speaker series, professional development, and full-time employment upon graduation. Meet Handshake, UTC's career platform for students and alumni. Handshake connects employers to students, matching employment interests to part-time, full-time, internships, and co-op employment. You can create a profile highlighting work history, academic accomplishments, and extracurricular activities. There are more than 8,000 employers in Handshake today looking to hire our UTC students and graduates. Connect with Nicole Wake for more information on how you can create an account today. Each semester, the Success Center hosts a workshop series to support you through your academic career. We offer tips and tricks to navigate stress management, goal setting, test anxiety, grad school applications, financial planning, and more. In addition to the university scholarships, the College of Engineering and Computer Science offers scholarship opportunities to our students. Applications open in October. Submit one application to be considered for more than 20 scholarships. Visit the CECS website for details. The CECS Center for Student Success looks forward to working with you through your academic career. Remember to visit us on Fridays and grab a bag of popcorn. Go Mocs!